In today's FX markets, let's take a look at the British pound futures as they're moving higher in today's session. British pound futures coming off of four days of selling pressure to retrace some of that selling pressure today, up about a third of a percent currently, right around the one spot 242 level. Now, intraday, we did see a high of one spot 2476, so we're well off the intraday highs, but still holding on to a gain here today and reversing some of the selling pressure from the previous four sessions. And we look at some of the driving factors today, a couple things to point to. Shifting of global trends, I think that continues uh, and that's helping to support some of the major FX markets today. Some of the concerns the market was contending with the last couple of weeks appear to be slowly working their way through uh, the banking sector issue and some of the dynamics in the inflation front as far as central bank activity. So I think that's one of the factors today. Couple that with the anticipation of uh, several uh, data points and uh, releases in the next couple of sessions here in the U.S., uh, highlighted by tomorrow's CPI data in the morning, then the FOMC minutes in the afternoon. So I think this could be a bit of a showing up of uh, positions heading into that data point and also a release from the FOMC later in the session. Looking at the general trends, uh, we're seeing the British pound futures uh, coming off of that selling pressure to trade higher. Now, when you look at it from a longer term perspective, uh, British pound futures are holding basically near uh, just off those 10 month highs they established uh, in the previous week. So even with the selling pressure, today's retracement has uh, pushed the British pound futures back up towards the top end of the recent range, which corresponds with 10 month highs. And most of the major FX markets are higher today across the board. Uh, the one caveat would be the Japanese yen is uh, pretty much unchanged on the session, but overall we're seeing strength in the Euro, uh, Swiss franc, uh, British pound, also uh, Australian dollar, Canadian dollar as well. So uh, again, uh, renewed strength here in most of the major FX markets today, coming off a little bit of selling pressure, but still for many of them holding near the top end of the range for the extended period.